my channel. This is the series lessons I've learned as a creative entrepreneur, and this is lesson number 19. If you haven't watched the other ones, click on the link here and it'll take you to the playlist of the first 19. I just remember that Laifa, I love Laifa on YouTube, said I talk too fast in my videos, so I'm going to try and slow down for you. But it's not easy. Anyhow, so today's lesson is just um, the fact that you shouldn't undervalue yourself. Um, for many people who become entrepreneurs, some people um, who become entrepreneurs because like, like life happens and like you have to make an income for, from their hobby. Um, <laughs> some people become entrepreneurs because life happens and they have to make an income from their hobby. And you know, because it was a hobby, they just, they don't, they don't charge right or they're selling themselves cheap. And the thing is, don't do that, like don't undervalue yourself. Um, your service or your product, your service is not inferior. I know it's easier to value, I feel like it's easier to value products because you would have bought it for a certain price and like maybe you want like a 10% margin, 10% margin, but um, the service is a bit different. So, um, don't undervalue yourself. Like, I keep on saying this because I undervalue myself for the longest time. But I attended an event called So Connected at the social place in PI and um, it was organized by Tola Saw, Tola Shule.